If you're running on AI agents using VoiceFlow, you probably hit this wall. Your client loves the agent you built, but when you need to share analytics or transcripts, it's just not professional. You end up manually creating reports in Google Sheets, can report clients automatically, and struggle to prove the value of your AI solution. I know this pain all too well because I've been running on AI chatbot agency for years. In this video, I'm going to show you exactly how to properly white label and serial your VoiceFlow agents professionally. Now let's talk about three biggest challenges you're facing as a voice flow agency owner right now. So the first challenge would be no professional white label solution. When you're selling AI agents to businesses, presentation matters a lot. But here's the problem. Voice flow doesn't give you a white label solution out of the box. Most agencies try to solve this in one of three ways. The first way is to manual spreadsheet reporting. This works, but it looks unprofessional and takes hours every time every single month. Second, custom dashboard development. This works great, but typically cost tens of thousands of dollars and takes months to build out. Lastly, just sharing the voice flow link. This is the easiest solution, but it completely eliminates your branding and makes your service look like a commodity. Plus, it confuses clients with technical elements they don't need to see. And to be honest, none of these solutions are ideal. Your clients want a professional branded experience that focuses on the results and value you're delivering. And secondly, if you're selling AI agents built on voice flow, you know the billing nightmare. Your clients are paying you based on usage, but tracking and billing for those messages manually is tedious. And let me walk you through what most agencies are doing right now. They would export usage data from multiple platforms, create custom invoices, send them to clients manually, follow up on payments, and finally repeat this process every single month. And this isn't just unknowing, it's preventing you from scaling. Every new client adds more admin overhead to your business. And last but not least, it's very hard to stand out in this commoditized market. When every agency can build AI agents, what makes yours different? And the truth is, the technical capabilities of your agents are important, but clients also judge you based on the complete experience you provide. Without a professional dashboard and reporting system, you're missing a critical opportunity to differentiate yourself from competitors who are offering essentially the same thing. In summary, selling voice flow agents, just using voice flow has limitations, causing branding and billing issues. And now let me show you what a proper voice flow agency setup looks like. It has three key components. First is branded client dashboard. Your clients should have a dashboard with your logo, your brand colors, custom domain, and only the features and metrics that are relevant to them. Here's what we built for our agency. Notice how clean and professional it looks. Clients can easily access conversation transcripts, see at a glance, and don't get overwhelmed with technical details they don't care about. The second would be automated billing solution. Your billing system should automatically track usage across platforms, generate invoices with your branding, process payments without manual innovation. This alone will save you countless hours each month and make your agency appear much more professional. Lastly, value-focused analytics. Your reporting should focus on proving the value of your AI solutions. It includes topic analysis to show what users are asking about, time saved for clients, and custom KPIs that matter to their business. Remember, clients don't buy AI agents. They buy outcomes. Your dashboard should constantly reinforce the value you're delivering. So for example, if you're building AI appointment setter, you should have metrics like this. Not answer calls, picked up, booked appointments. So this shows how many of leads are not answered on calls. And this shows how many of the leads have picked up the phone and had a conversation with AI agent. And this shows, you know, how many appointments have booked through this agent. And th the most important metric here is, of course, booked appointments. Because this clearly shows the ROI of the investment. So now we have covered three key components of proper white label dashboard for your voiceful agency and three ways to implement this solution. The first option would be building it yourself from scratch. The advantage of this option would be a complete control over your dashboard, but it costs you thousands of dollars and it takes you know, months of development. And also after building the first version of your dashboard, it requires a lot of maintenance effort. And the second option would be coupling together existing tools like Looker Studio and Google Spreadsheets. Of course, you can build your dashboard with lower cost, but there will be disjointed experience and still requires a lot of manual work. And the last option would be using a white label third party dashboard like ChatDash. It provides you a quick setup and professional look, and it requires no development. But the downside is 
of course you need to pay monthly subscription fee and there's some limitations on customization for sure because you are using a SaaS platform you're not building it from scratch and most agencies i work with choose option three because it provides the best balance of professional appearance quick implementation and reasonable cost so using the third option which is chat dash let me walk you through what the setup process looks like first you need to configure branded dashboard under your agency's branding and you create client login credentials basically creating a sub account and you connect a voice flow agent into chat dash and you set up a stripe rebuilding based on your pricing model and this entire process takes less than 30 minutes and once it's done your clients will have a professional experience that truly sets you apart now let me actually walk you through the process of adding voice flow agents to chat dash set up your first client dashboard first you want to log into chat dash and first you want to do is basically adding your custom domain if you have one but if you don't have your custom domain ready you can always use one of our subdomains that are given to you and next thing you want to do is to go to clients tab and you want to create a new client and give your client name voice flow client login id client password and you can select the language of your client as well so if you select korean here your client dashboard will be translated in korean and let's create it so i just created a voice flow client here and what i'm going to do is to go to chatbots and click on add chatbot and click voice flow and i need two information from voice flow which are dialog api key and project id and let me go to voice flow sign in so if i went to this agent click on designer back and so i want to go to interfaces and click on api keys and copy this api key they used to have different set of api keys but they i think they have only one api key right now so just copy this and paste it here and for project id going back to voice flow you can grab it in settings general and metadata there's a project ID here paste it and you want to give the chatbot name the voice flow sample a lot of people are asking about this option and it's basically if you turn this on you're basically saying that you're, you're going to be using voice flows chat widget instead of ours but in this case for this demo i'll just turn this off to showcase our widget and click on create yeah yeah just created this voice flow agent here and going back to clients and now i need to connect these two i'm going to click on project assign and click on voice flow sam sample and assign and boom that's pretty much it for your first client dashboard if you want to see your client dashboard you want, to, you want to click on preview button here and now we don't have any data but you get the idea like all the analytics and conversation will be you'll be able to see all the knowledge base of this agent of course you know this logo will be replaced with yours and you can also set up the color theme now i said you know as sky blue but you can change it whenever you want and by clicking client access you can also control over your client's journey meaning that you can you know basically turn on and off like every sidebar menus in your client dashboard so let's say if i turn this project settings on and click changes and if i go back to preview again now i see another menu called project settings on the client dashboard and in here yes they can they can now talk to this chatbot inside their client dashboard so for rebuilding clients let me walk you through the interactive demo here yeah so you want to go to stripe building and connect your start account for sure and just you know go through the onboarding process and new connected account will be created under your uh, Stripe account and after adding your Stripe account you want to go to subscription products and create a product and you can choose price model based subscription fee or usage based and based subscription fee model allows you to have have a retainer with included usage and after that you can charge over fee so in this example you can um, so you're charging hundred dollars for the first thousand interactions and interactions are just messages user messages and after that your client will be charged 50 cents per message alternatively you can use usage based so that your client will be charged purely on usage and if you click create you will get this stripe product created in chat dash what you can do is just go to product settings and go to stripe billing menu and simply assign it to one of your client's projects so once they log in the only thing they can do is to add their payment information and after adding a payment information they will get access to the client dashboard and they can manage their subscription right inside their client dashboard as well so there you have it a complete guide to properly white labeling and selling your voiceful agents here's what i covered why the standard voiceful setup is holding back your agency 
the three key components of a professional solution and how to implement the white label dashboard for your clients. If you are tired of manual reporting, building headaches, and struggling to stand out in the market, I've got a solution that might help. At ChatDash, we built the only platform that allows you to white label for voice flow, N8N, retail app, open AI assistant, and more, all in one dashboard. You get a fully customizable client dashboard with your branding, or extra rebuilding, in-depth transcript analytics, and even a mini CR with outbound calling campaigns. And the best part, it takes less than 30 minutes to set everything up, and your clients will immediately see the difference. If you'd like to see how ChatDash can help your agency deliver a more professional experience while saving you hours of manual work, click the link in the description to learn more and start your free trial. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.